Only a date. If you know, you know. That's what we're reacting to. Let's go. Oh, this is what happens when the repo man comes. Especially like cars nowadays, they got GPS in there. They're gonna find you. Man, this dude just don't give a fuck. Look at that. He just gonna destroy his car, but I guess that's better than getting it towed, I guess. Yo, you're gonna pop your truck. Let it down. Something. Let it down. He's going to pop your shit. Go, boy. Dale, dale, vete, mi hermano. That's not bad. He didn't take that much damage. And then also, like, if you have, like, a low car, like, that thing's just going to be messed up for days or forever. <laughs> Yo. Oh, man. A repo man's just going to be like, I'm going to find you. I'm gonna find you on the Google Maps. I'm gonna find you. Let's check out some of these comments. This one says, Buddy is going to jail and he's gonna have to pay for the tow truck damages. Is that true? Let me know. It's illegal to repo with someone in the car. Literally, the law. I don't know if that's the truth or not. The one today, repo man will be back tomorrow. That's like a real American saying but he's gonna find him today. This person says, how is a 2007 F-350 shit box out for repo? Well, I mean, if you stop paying those payments, they'll come They'll come get anything. Even if you had like a cat on a payment, they'll take a cat. Oh, this person says, it's illegal for a tow truck not to have their company name on the side of their vehicles. You cannot block out or you definitely cannot take a vehicle with a person inside. That's called a hostile towing, and it's against the law. Is that true? That probably is. It sounds pretty dangerous. Sad thing is, the repo man is only doing his job, and that is true. He's just doing his job. He's going to take his cat. Some of these people are like, why not just pay your bills? Of course, if he could pay his bills, he wouldn't be doing that. This is the most miami shit I've ever seen. <laughs> the boat says Lucifer, and she's like, or is that a dude? I don't know if that's a dude or a chick. They're on a strip pole. My life. She was spinning earlier, y'all. Hold on, wait, watch this. They're just showing her butthole all over the place. Showing the butthole to the, the great Shamu or something. First of all, the core power for that, while you're on the water, crazy. And yeah, you, you probably have to be, well, doing things on a, a strip pole, you have to be pretty strong, you know? You gotta be strong. You go, girl. Oh, I guess it is a girl. This dude says, I'm riding by a jet ski and throwing ones. Bro, up that to fives or tens. Nah, I'm just kidding. Hit throw some coins. Miami is a joke sometimes. Eh, yeah, this is it's pretty wild. <laughs> this person says, how do you get invited though? They want that invite. We need this in GTA 6. That would be pretty, that would be pretty sick. Miami characters include stripper poles. Not not far from the point. Yacht charters be like stripper poles included. That's that's a pretty good selling point, right? No, no. It would take a lot to shock me in Miami. It's pretty much like a zoo, a human zoo. <laughs> like first of all, how how does that even happen? <laughs> They're just like driving, just like <laughs> just take like a hard left. Whoa. Was that a baby on board sign? I'm just kidding. There's no, there's no, there's no sign. File report because a car hit them and then a motorcyclist hit the car. So I'm going Miami. You can't drive. Shit. There's only two lights people know in Miami: <laughs> the brake light and their high beams. Then that's it. No, no turn signal. That doesn't exist. Hey, free water right there. Hopefully it's ocean water, right? Sea level. What is happening? Everybody's going to move. This dude says everybody's going to move. move I don't I don't understand like why people drive on the opposite side of like the highway on oncoming traffic. It just doesn't make any sense. Oh yeah, this all the time, like it could like be one drop of rain and it'll be flooded. 
just straight flooded. Why would you have to go to the ocean when the ocean just comes to you? Oh yeah, nobody can park. Nobody can park. That's why you see so many messed up cars. Insurance is like super high. It, it's just crazy. Y'all, tell me you're from Hialeah without telling me you're from Hialeah. Ghetto. <laughs> uh, no, actually, maybe that's really uh, the smart to do because now you're just like recycling, right? Yeah, like... <laughs> this ghetto ass shit. I'm dead. There we go again. Only in the river date. Like I'm saying, like literally one drop of rain and your whole yard is flooded. Whole parking lot is flooded. Let's go back. What was that? Look at this person's car to the right. Like, are they in like a, a sinkhole or something? Or, or did their tire go to another portal or something? To a different world? There we go. Might as well just park on the sidewalk no. at this point. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, this too. Like, I, I don't understand like how that happens. I, I see this a lot. Oh, Marshalls? Oh, Marshalls, I'm just kidding. Also, there's a ton of like Marshalls like everywhere. That's like Walmart for clothes here or something. This motherfucker got a rap sheet of tickets, boy. That looks like a, a scroll from ancient Rome. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> Sheesh. Sheesh. He just got 10% off of the next CVS purchase. <laughs> this officer made her goal for the month already. Yeah, most definitely did. She could go sit back and chill out. Guy got all the coupons. Where's the dude that like Chuck E. Cheese and he's getting like the, the long like tickets to go buy some grand prize of gel. Getting ready for the mommy CVS Halloween costume edition. This dude, I think the driver going to start traveling on the subway now. No, I think this dude's going to start walking. So dude got all sorts of discounts. She rolling up the toilet paper so then she can clean his ass with it. <laughs> yeah, you're going to be dropping the soap. <laughs> <laughs> this dude's doing like a casual jog so it looks like he's like running away from somebody and he's casually jogging not even trying to run <laughs> then i think he was saying like why y'all snitching or why you're filming or something <laughs> <laughs> this dude like how he like jumps over the bush he just like <laughs> Like, what was that, bro? Like, you never did, like, high jump or, like, hurdles in college or high school? <laughs> what is he doing? Get on the ground. Don't fucking move. Don't you move, Don't you move. Turn around. Man, they got the tasers out and everything. Yeah. I mean, they even need all that because this dude runs like a grandpa. He jumped into the bushes like there was a portal for him to go away. Too many video games. Why is he running in slow motion? That is exactly what I said. Walmart Olympics. <laughs> Walmart Olympics. Yeah, that's about it. I hope you got a little taste of the Miami vibes. It's different if you like vacay here. It's also different if you actually live here. But until next time.